more and more people riding their bikes to get from point A to B, a viewer called our newsroom asking what the rules of the road are when it comes to bikes and cars. To verify, we spoke to Rachel Holler. She's the executive director of Bike Walk Macon and also looked at the Bicyclist Pocket Guide, which lays out the latest state codes put together by Georgia Bikes. Kayla Solomon also spent the day finding out what laws are currently in place for bike riders and if they're different from regular traffic laws. Riding around Macon is a bit hairy. Uh, I was used to in other places that I've lived. I've been happy commuting. I don't love commuting here. Jim Langstaff is the manager at Bike Tech Macon, and he's also an avid bike rider. It's got some stretches of road that are just entirely no-go zones, it seems like, for, for bikes, uh, sections of Forest Hill that will hopefully be redone soon, and um, some, some areas of Vineville and Forsyth that certain times of the day. Langstaff says because Macon doesn't have bike lanes in most areas, there could be some confusion about where cyclists can and can't ride around the city. I, I don't know all the laws of the road for um, cars or bikes. It just takes education. Hopefully more of that happens. Um, He's like dozens of people who do not know what is and isn't permitted when it comes to sharing the road with cars. So we asked, what are the laws for cyclists here in Georgia? Bicycles are vehicles. Um, they have to follow all of the rules of the road that a car does. Um, so you have to stop at stoplights, you have to stop at stop signs, um, you have to travel on the road that you're supposed to be traveling in the right direction. Rachel Holler with Bike Walk Macon verifies that the laws are the same for bikes and cars. It's unlawful for a bicyclist over the age of 16 years old to be on the sidewalk. They're supposed to travel like a car. Um, they're supposed to be in the street. She says cyclists could get ticketed for not following the laws just like drivers do. In Macon, Kayla Solomon, 13 WMAZ News. Rachel Holler says back in 2015 there was only one mile of bike lanes in Macon. Now there's almost six.